cute videos, you know what I'm saying? So if you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. So today we're gonna create a Halloween look. So I already did my brows. I put a little bit of mascara on because I didn't wanna look too dead. I just woke up, it's like 8 a.m. Well, I didn't just wake up, I woke up like at seven. But it's super early. And I wanted to create this look before my son wakes up because then I won't be able to like talk through it. And I do apologize if you hear like these beeping noises. I have a parrot and yeah, he's a little loud in the mornings when everyone's awake. So if he hears any of us wake up, like he'll start like talking and making noises. So yeah, sorry about that. But let's get to it people. Before we get into it, go ahead and pause this video, subscribe to my channel, and like and comment any little comments down below if you guys want to try this look out, what do you guys think, so yeah. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mark on my nose like where I want to start. So, <laughs> so we are going to take our Nose and Scar Wax by Ben I. So you want to coat your fingers in like some type of face oil or Vaseline. I'm using um, Makeup Revolution's CBD oil. Alright, so I'm going to grab about this much right here and I'm just going to Go ahead and start placing it on here. Now, you see how it gets like sticky like that? That's because you need more oil. And it's gonna be a lot easier to manage if you do that. So I'm just starting to smooth everything out. So we're gonna be starting out by layers, so I'm gonna be um, like putting it on little by little. So I'm just kind of building um, like the ridges up here and then smoothing everything out. So this is my first time doing this type of makeup, like special effects makeup, and I'm actually following a video 
Um, I will link it down below. Her name is Carolina something. I have to look it up. But I will link it down below for you guys to um, see the video as well. And that's basically what I was following. I mean, there's so many talented people nowadays that it's like, it's so cool to see everybody's like talents and stuff. Like, it's just, to me, it's like super amazing. <laughs> I don't know why I keep having my mouth open. I'm like, This is a long process, a super long process, it really is. So the next part we're going to be adding liquid latex to our face. So <clears throat> this is from Ben I, I'm just putting it in this little like flash box thing, tying that all over our face. I need to hurry before this stuff dries on my face. So sorry if I look weird right now, but I need to hurry up. So we're going to start putting some cotton on our face. This is supposed to create texture. So that's what I'm doing. This feels so weird. I feel like Santa Claus right now. <laughs> I really do. I mean, hopefully I'm doing this right. I'm literally just following a video. I think I put on too much cotton, so I'm just going to start picking stuff off. So, <laughs> uh, yeah. So now that we look like Santa Claus, I'm going to put on more liquid latex. It's so early for this, like, who am I right now? <laughs> My husband's still sleeping, so when he wakes up, he's gonna be like, what the hell? But he's used to this crap already, so. Okay, so while we wait for the latex to dry, I'm gonna go ahead and start on my eyes. I'm just um, prepping them with concealer. This is by Tarte, it's called Light Neutral, it's the Shape Tape. And then I'm gonna go ahead and go into this new Pixie palette. It's a collab with Heart Defensor on Instagram. Her name is actually That's Heart on Instagram. And I'm gonna go ahead and just blend that out and use that color on obviously both eyes. 
and um, then we're gonna go ahead and just use like a kind of like a darker a deeper red and we're gonna put that in our crease so I'm just gonna let you guys watch what I do and I'll go ahead and put um, the details down below on what I used So I didn't record the whole eye look, but I do add lashes and then I add a color to my bottom lash line and that's pretty much it on what I do. And later on, you know, add some foundation and all that stuff. So yeah, just keep on watching. We are going to take our Ben Eye um, cream color in brush cut and we're going to start just coloring So don't worry if you have white parts because we're about to cover that with blood anyways. So for this part, we're just going to start lifting the mask all around. And just make sure it has oil on your spatula, that way it doesn't get stuck. So we're trying to create that effect that it's like our skin like popping off, kind of like a mask looking thing. Alright, here comes the fun part now. We're going to be adding some fresh scab. It's this jelly blood. So now I'm just ripping off some of that liquid latex that's at the bottom of my chin just to give it more of an effect of like my skin coming off and then we're going to add some blood to that. I got some good old stage blood here. I'm gonna take this little stipple thing. Probably shouldn't have wore this white sweater. Now that I'm thinking about it. Okay. 
So once you're done, you'll just add some foundation, lashes, and just make it your own look, whatever you want to do. I did not record it because I wanted the main attraction to be basically my Halloween makeup. And we're done. That's basically it. Bye. Thank you guys for watching. This is the completed look, masquerade look. So I hope that you guys try this out. Um, let me know in the comments how you liked it. Um, it's pretty easy once you get the hang of it. This is my first time creating this and it's just, it's just so much fun. Okay, so anyways, hope you guys like this completed Halloween look. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel and comment down below what you're gonna be for Halloween this year, okay? And follow me on Instagram at SoCal underscore X. Bye guys, have a happy Halloween.